of mine, uh, an Indian actress, Madhu Kapoor, who now lives in LA, she said that this great Indian yoga guru, Vikram, and almost every Hollywood celebrity is his student. Right. My dream was to meet the yoga guru Vikram and co-founder, his wife Rajshree, to be able to meet Hollywood celebrities and further my career of working in Hollywood films. I look up to her. She is a wonderful, wonderful, warm, uh, uh, fabulous person. I have ever come across her in real culture. And of course, uh, I'll be missing uh, Vikram Da. I wish he was here to, uh, you know, that he could witness all of us over here sitting on the dais. And what, you know, enough, you know, I, I, there's, I have no words really to express ke, uh, what this experience has been for me. It's been completely life changing for me. And, uh, well, I have just started uh, doing uh, hot yoga, so I am not yet, I am still a student, learning uh, and uh, trying to uh, uh, work as hard as possible and please my guru over there sitting right in front of me. A big welcome to you all, members of the press, and ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for coming here. My uh, special thanks to all the instructors who are sitting there who have been absolutely fantastic in helping me and, and uh, a lot of other people in developing their yoga skills. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here with Rajshri. Thank you very much for calling me here. And my dear colleague Anil Kapoor, it's always a pleasure to be here. And Gushan. Before it was, of course, it is from India, but then when it went to the lost America and Western world in Europe and every other countries, they started practicing and accepting more. And over there, people are very smart. They don't take things unless it's really helpful or effective very fast. So what they have seen it that it's not only the practice, they took it in the scientific also form and they figured it out that it is the only way that you can have a complementary medicine without taking any medicine or drug, you can find a full fitness. Because before fitness used to be about the physical health, now they figure out that it's not about physical health, emotional health is important. Depending on emotional medicine all the time, it's not helping anything else, you know. So you have all the medicine as a side effect. So they started enjoying it, liking and getting popular, of course, because it's accepted by America and Europe. Now they have been, Indians are thinking of, okay, why not yoga in here? <laughs> 